hello friends welcome back to my channel at everyone so guys in this video today we will learn how to enable or disable or you can say turn on on and turn off windows features so we have multiple features in windows 10 windows 11 or if you are using windows 8 or 7 so i'll show you step by step how you can enable or turn on windows features or if required how you can turn off or disable windows features okay step by step but before going ahead i want to request you if you are a new user from my channel please subscribe just to motivate me just to support me and don't forget to click on the bell icon so that whenever i'll upload the new videos you will get the notification let's start now so you have to go to the control panel by clicking here on the start menu or just click here in the search bar and then type your control once you'll type control you have to go to control panel just click on that okay and then you have to go to the program and features option so just click on that you can open program and features option okay from here or just go to run menu and type here upwiz.cpl command just click to ok and this window will be opened directly so either you can go to the control panel and then go to windows features and then go to uh, here on this option turn windows features on or off okay so you need to click here on the turn windows features on or off once you will click this small window will be opened okay and here you can see all features are listed okay and whatever the features you want to enable you can enable from here okay like if you want to enable hyper b you can enable just by select this okay there are multiple other features so you can just expand and expand this and you can select or you can enable the hyper v as per your requirement or you can enable the other features as well as per your requirement okay so you need to just select okay like if you want to uh, enable nfs services you need to just select you want to enable any other services like virtual machine platform windows hyper hypervisor platform just you need to select okay and then you need to click okay okay so once you'll click to okay if it will search the required files windows will search the required files and you can see it will apply the changes and once it will be applied your windows features will be enabled okay so in this way you can enable windows features you can turn on windows features or if you already enabled and if you want to disable or turn off the windows feature you need to just if it is already selected just uncheck the option like if you want to uh, turn off smb direct or a telnet client feature you need to just select it is already selected you need to just uncheck this box and then click to ok the again the uh, it will it will apply the changes and once it will be completed the features will be turned off or the features will be turned on okay so guys it will take some time so the same process you need to follow and once it will get up once it will be get applied you need to just restart your system so that it will be uh it will be the other services will be uh, get reflected so i hope you 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 have the visibility now and or you can say it is clear to you now how you can enable or turn on or turn off the windows features okay you can see it is completed and now it is asking like windows needs to reboot your pc to finish installing the requested changes okay so you need to restart i am not going to restart for now because if i'll restart the recording will be stopped so you have to just restart and then you need to check 
the features if it is enabled or not but yes you can enable them in this way by following these steps so guys i hope this video will be helpful for you so again i request you to please subscribe my channel it Parivar, like this video and share with your friends thanks for watching it Parivar. bye bye